tomorrow, together. Siegson was a Wayland yutani competitor founded in 2034, standing out amongst other companies during the advent of faster-than-light travel. Founded by Josiah Sieg and originally known by the name of Sieg & Son, the Siegson Corporation entered the race into space and built the components that enabled ships to extend colonial space beyond the Sol system. As history relates, Wayland Corporation was reluctant to share FTL technologies with other corporations, though Sieg himself was known as a determined innovator and pushed the company to its full potentials. According to the text Together Tomorrow, Siegson's Journey into Colonial Space, an official history by Sebastian Sieg, Sieg & Son proved to be the backbone of colonial FTL expansion, providing reliable components that could carry humanity deep into space. In so doing, it grew, and by 2066 was running vast manufacture plants in London, Buenos Aires, Nagasaki, and the lunar frontier. By 2071, the year the Sieg family sold its shares back into the company, its expansion remained exponential. Single-minded rivals looked on with envy as Sieg & Son became market leaders, manufacturing cars, chemicals, educational equipment, and building materials. Towards the end of the last century came a move that would forge our shared future. Sieg & Son became Siegson. We took on the name our customers had known us by for decades, and we turned to face tomorrow together, among the stars. While Siegson prepared for its ascension into colonial space, its foothold was under construction. Sevastopol, a station with unparalleled potential, and a perfect position in deep space. Sevastopol began as Freeport, built by Lorenz Sistec Development and funded by our friends at Geofun Investor. The station's opening would, however, coincide with tumult in the space race. Years of mismanagement and the rerouting of the Sol Thetis flight path left Sevastopol in real danger of being decommissioned. Thankfully, Siegson were waiting in the wings to re-energize this station, among many others. In 2124, we arrived in Sevastopol and made possible the buzzing cosmopolitan hub you see today. With the guidance of key Siegson executive talent, Sevastopol has become an outpost of progress, a trade hub, a vibrant community, and the beating heart of the Siegson synthetic solution. Sevastopol is the primary off-planet site for the development, sales, and maintenance of Sikhs and androids. From Sevastopol's unique position in the cosmos, we can ship our range of working Joes wherever they're needed in colonial space within months, not years. Above and beyond our reliable and cost-efficient synthetics is Sevastopol's governing, at Siegson's award-winning Apollo system. Through the hard work of our scientists and Siegson's bold investments, the station is now a showcase for the economical and self-governing artificial human operations. Even now, our sales executives are overseeing the population of Apollo mainframes across space. While Siegson didn't become a gargantuan power like Wayland yutani the company certainly left its mark, and perhaps is best known for its Android series of Working Joes. While mostly prominent in the video game Alien Isolation, mention of Siegson has popped up here and there, particularly in the newer continuity found in the Shadows trilogy. Not much has been revealed yet in regards to Siegson in the aftermath of the Xenomorph outbreak on Sevastopol Station, so we may have to wait for a sequel to the game to find out more. Though aside from an Alien Isolation sequel, would you be interested in seeing more of this competitor company? Do you think some interesting conflicts and or corporate espionage may have gone on behind the scenes between Wayland and Siegson? Comment below and let me know your thoughts. And as always, thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit the like button, and you can also subscribe for all the latest videos from the channel. If you have a suggestion for a video, please comment below and let me know. In the meantime, you can follow the channel on social media, check out at alien underscore theory on Twitter, and at alien theory yt on Facebook and Instagram for more things alien related. And until next time, this is Alien Theory, signing off.